Okay, so a new Wes Anderson film has just hit Netflix. It is called The Wonderful Story of Henry Sugar. Okay, so Anderson writes and directs, right? The film is produced by Stephen Rails, Jeremy Dawson. It is co-produced by Alice Dawson, John Pete, and Octavia Pizel, and also Adam Buckner produces the VFX. Robert D. Yeoman handles cinematography. Barney Pilling and Andrew Wisebloom edit the piece. Adam Stockhausen is on production design. Art decoration, art direction even, is Richard Hardy, Claire Peerless, and Kevin Timon Hill. Set decoration is Kathy Featherstone and Anna Pinnock. Costume design, we have... Cassia Waliki Mira Moon. Boof, butchered that. And our cast, well, Benedict Cumberbunch is Henry Sugar. Um, we have got Ben Kingsley as Imdad Khan. Dev Patel is Dr. Chatterjee and John Winston. Richard Aedi is Dr. Marshall and the Yogi. Okay, so Ralph Fiennes is um, Ronald Dahl. And Rupert Friend is Claude. Okay, so this is an adaptation of a short story from uh, Ronald Dahl called The Wonderful World of Henry Sugar and Other Stories, right? Uh, so the gist is this. Henry, oh, boom, boom, boom. The gist is, a rich man learns about a guru who can see without using his eyes. That man is Henry Sugar. He then sets out to master that same skill as he feels it will be beneficial in him to continue to make money. All right, so this is actually the first of four short stories from went Wes Anderson, which are adapted from Ronald Dahl stories. All right, now this is 39 minutes, right? So definitely short. The others are a lot shorter. I think they're like 10, 15 minutes, you know what I mean? But this was, it was really interesting. Like, production wise and everything there's it kind of to me felt like a play right it, it, it the, the way everyone projected at you you know what i mean they, they, it was like they were they were looking at an audience and and projecting right and then you also had the sets moving Right, and visibly moving like they would in a theater, which was interesting. Like you had people walk onto the screen and pick up something and walk off, or walk on holding something and giving it to a character. So, yeah, it felt like this, you know, fantastical production, which was interesting. It definitely had that Wes Anderson feel to it. You know, I think if you hadn't seen the name attached, you'd watch this and go, did Wes Anderson do it? You know what I mean? I don't know. There's just something about his films that you instantly know he's had a part in it. You know what I mean? And so, yeah, you, you have these characters and, you know, you've got um, the Ronald Dahl character, 
you know, being being played by Ralph Fiennes. Um, and you also get like narration from Henry Sugar, right? Uh, the Benedict Cumberbatch character. And actually, from a few of them, right? Uh, Deb Patel's Dr. Chatterjee, you know, Ben Kingsley's The Imad, a few of the characters talk to the audience, right? So it, it's this, yeah, just a, it's, it's, it's a really interesting way to tell this story, right? So it starts off with, you know, Ronald Dahl, and he's talking, and then he's like, oh, and yeah, so Henry Sugar. So we go into the Henry Sugar part. He finds a book, which then leads us into the Imdad Khan story. You know, so it's this, yeah, interesting way that we jump from different components and different parts of the world and just everything like that. Yeah, you know, I was yeah, I was definitely intrigued. And I think 39 minutes works. I don't know if this could work over like 90 plus. I think you might be a little distracted, a little you might get a little tired of it at that point. But over this duration and doing it in the manner in which they have. I think it, it, it's quirky and interesting enough to go, hi, right, I'm, I'm curious to see where this goes, you know? It's, uh, yeah, it's a little bizarre. It's a little bizarre because, again, right, with the, the cast talking to the audience, as it were, it's also a little bit, different than if you're watching a film, right, and people and characters are interacting with each other and acting, right, it, it's slightly, it has a slightly different feel than that, yeah, and even a slightly different feel than a theatre production. I was intrigued, I think if you enjoy a quirky story, Right, if you enjoy a Wes Anderson story, I think the you know the wonderful story of Henry Sugar will be very compelling to you. You know, it was yeah, it was fun. Everyone did a solid job. You know, the, the we have some vibrant colors and different feels as we hit these different, you know locations right and just the you know unique way that the backgrounds and sets are utilized so yeah i enjoyed it right it's now on netflix the wonderful story of henry sugar